Good morning, world. I uh, just wanted to show you guys my uh, garden that I have in front of my house here. Um, shit's doing well. Probably made, I don't know, an update a couple weeks ago, but I don't know. Stuff's doing pretty good. Um, some massive bell peppers over here. I've already picked a few of them, but I'm not sure if they're done. I don't know why this one's still like all red and shit. Actually, you know what? I think it's supposed to turn red. That was probably why they didn't taste that great, but they're still pretty fucking big and nice and whatnot, so. Another one right there. These are, uh, I think Anaheim peppers. One of these is an Anaheim pepper. I'm not really sure, actually. But, uh, check out this tomato plant. Alright, this is from a seed, just a random ass tomato. Um, I don't really know how it got there because I don't remember putting it there, but. Like, take example for these bitches right here. This is a patch of tomato plants. Like, I just took a, a tiny cherry tomato just like you see right here. Um, and I just fucking, I just broke it open and just kind of spread it around. And like a week later, there was a bunch of these fucking, these little, like, plants coming up. I didn't even, I forgot what they were and then like, soon enough, you know, they started turning into tomato plants. Um, I'm guessing there's probably 10 of them there, or 15 or 20, who knows, but, uh, this one's just, like, one that got put in later, and then this fucker right here, dude, I swear to God, this has not been in here for even, like, a month, dude, and it's insane, like, maybe it's more than one, I doubt it, though, um, we tied them up, and it seemed to help a lot, I seemed to get a lot bigger, if you, like, you know, help support it and whatnot, but, uh, yeah, whoever says fucking clones, are like better than seeds dude that's so much bullshit honestly because a seed grows so much more like full and like just like vigorous like like it grows I think it grows faster I mean after a certain point the plants already so big you know it's like they're all they're all growing pretty fast but like a clone the only advantages to having a clone of anything dude is that you get the same exact genetics every time so you get the same like basically the same yield you know in terms of you know, what it's capable of, um, you're always guaranteed to have, you know, a good plant to some degree, but honestly, they just take way too fucking long, um, the only other advantage I can think of to a clone is that you can see if green your plants easier, you know, you can have them all at the same height, they don't get, like, too wide, um, but yeah, that's about it, honestly, seeds are the way to go, I'm definitely gonna take some of these seeds next year and just not even bother with the, the clones that, um, like these came from over here, like, like look at this thing, this is like, I think this is just one plant, um, it's just kind of spread out, I'm not really sure, I, I, before that's all I saw, so, I don't know, might be two, um, over here though, these are the clones, these ones, I have no idea why, they just fucking completely decided to die, um, but they're still producing tomatoes for whatever reason, they seem to be getting pretty munched on by bugs, but, yeah, as you can see, 70% plus of this growth is just gone, this is another, uh, cutting, um, I think, I'm not really sure, this is a pear style tomato, I don't really know what it's called, and then this one over here, which is an heirloom, which I was very disappointed, because it's not really an heirloom, it's just the cherry kind, uh, this over here, though, are the real heirlooms, these are about ready to be picked, probably, see, nice and red, juicy, probably pick that in a couple days, um, these were, uh, probably cl clones, um, they came from my neighbor, uh, my, uh, my mom's friend, um, she had to dig up or, uh, fill in all the land in her backyard and they didn't have any room for it, so, um, they gave them to us, we transplanted these four right here, and, uh, as you can see, they all are doing decently well, they didn't grow that much, this one obviously isn't doing too well, but it still had a few tomatoes, a fat fucking stem right there, damn, um, but yeah, if anybody knows why the hell these died, let me know, I, I'm, I think it might have been from compost tea that I let sit for too long, and I just fed it to them, maybe there's some kind of disease in it, I don't really know. Alright, uh, but yeah, check out these fucking sunflowers, these are sick. I'm like close to six foot, I'm like 5'10", so right here, dude, that's probably like, I don't know, close to seven feet at the top. Pretty cool. Just out of straight compost, or uh, not straight compost, I mean, there's hella like compost in here. I'm like, we've been adding it over the years and whatnot, just like in the backyard. This here is a lemon tree, it came from Costco. Uh, it's grown probably two feet since we got it. It's looking good, we want to put it in there like three, four months ago. Um, some more sunflowers. All these didn't grow as big though because I transplanted them. Um, and they probably got shocked from, I don't know, maybe too much compost tea or something. I don't really know, but they're, they're cool right now. 
I'm guessing these will have a bunch of seeds. We've grown these before, but uh, honestly, these sunflowers, I just took some seeds that we had that were probably like three years old, and I just started throwing them everywhere, and that's basically the result of what they came from. Um, there was a fat-ass squash right there that grew insane. There's the remains of it right there. Oop, huh, Coop? I don't even know if these are edible or not. They probably are, but I don't like that shit anyway, so fuck it. Um, strawberry patch. Honestly, these things, when they touch the ground, they just get all fucked up. But here's a nice one. Oh, I need that. Oops. Yeah, see, that probably is not even done yet. But, uh, yeah, I think these are supposed to stay around for at least a couple years. Um, I don't really know, though. Next season, hopefully, they'll be better. Um, this is probably like one of the only things I even use in this garden, except for the tomatoes, which I'm definitely going to eat. But uh, these chives, um, which they're not doing really good. They're really thin. Um, they don't really have as much flavor because of that. Uh, the springtime is when they're really good, but uh, I still occasionally come out here and chop these, a couple of these down and make some fucking Gordon Ramsay eggs. Um, yeah. Let's see, what else do I got here? That's about it. Oh, I guess I can show you my other... Tiny ass plant. I'm gonna try the strawberry though. Mm. Just brush my teeth, so that's a little sour, but damn, I think it might have been sour anyways. Holy shit. Some of the other ones have been pretty good though. Um, alright. Check it out. <sighs> this shit's not really growing massively, but it's hanging in there. Uh, started it in the sun, and it's grown fine since then. Um, again, I plan on LSTing it just right on behind here so it doesn't get seen, but it probably won't even get more than 10 grams or so. I have no idea, but 10 grams is 10 grams. It's worth like 100 bucks at least. Uh, just a seed though. It's on uh, its second node so far. Um, it's supposed to get like 98 degrees a day, so I uh, thought about moving it out somewhere, but uh, we just put it right here and hopefully it won't get too much. Uh, the other one, which I have in the shade right now, just because... Oh, fuck! That's why you don't fucking come out here without shoes on. Other one, shade. Um, hopefully it does better outside than inside. Um, going on, rambling on. Uh, pumpkins are doing good. Compost, good. Can't wait for next year. Peace, one love, happy growing. What's good, everybody? Uh, fucking, I just found this, uh, this light fixture in my, uh, garage, and, uh, it didn't have the, uh, correct wiring or, uh, a bulb, and I fucking just found this cord in there also, it has a, a, a plug into it, um, so I just spent, like, I don't know, a half an hour just soldering these two wires together, just cause I don't even know how to do it, but somehow I figured it out, whatever, check it out. Shazam! Shit works! Fucking, I'm just gonna put it right back along this uh, drawer right here. And uh, I'll stick that uh, blackberry seedling back in here. Um, yeah. Alright everybody. Peace. Happy growing. Later.